Hey, what's going on guys? Today I want to show you a really cool ROM, which is actually based on AOSP and not on CyanogenMod. And I've been searching for a nice ROM for a very, very long time for the <clears throat> G3, which is the D855 model. But this ROM is also available for different versions of the phone. And as you can see here in settings, this is actually based off AOSP. Um, this is based off the official Google release. And this phone is not very fast on 5.1.1 ROMs like Lollipop. I've had many problems which um, resulted in a very slow phone, a very laggy phone. And um, on previous versions of Android like 5.1.1, um, which were based off CyanogenMod on this phone. I've had to mess around with the kernel like um, CPU governor. Um, I've set it to conservative to make the phone a little bit faster. And as you can see, the animations are so fast. I'm very glad I, I found this ROM. You can get the latest ROM onto your phone with the um, with the Exodus updater app, which comes with the ROM when you install it. I will give you the G apps in the description and also the link to the nightly builds. In this updater app, you can get the nightly builds, open delta builds, so you can check the supported devices. And there are also settings. Uh, you can change your schedule for updates, of course. This one is really nice. It gives you a lot of performance, which is needed on this phone, because this phone has a little bit of problems with the UI and stutter because the uh, graphic unit in this device um, has to support a lot of pixels on this phone um, which was the problem for me at least with the lollipop builds of CyanogenMod but this phone is now based off AUSP and you can check out the settings real quick you can see the customization options are hidden so if you scroll through, you will not see any customization center. Just go on the top right corner, the menu um, key here. You can check out wallpapers for Exodus in this really nice app with a very nice moving layout. There is a layers manager. You can install it and mess around with the themes. Let's check out the other interface options like status bar navigation bar you can compare these to the respection remix customization of course let's go to hardware playback control um, seek music tracks press power button twice for camera this is really nice very nice function uh, power button twice on the back real quick go for camera uh, this key if you wonder what this is uh, you can press it and go to the app which you opened like um, before so go to Google Play Store press this key you will go back to settings go back to Google Play and go back to settings really fast very flawless works every time as you can see here a very very fluid experience on this phone I'm very glad I found this ROM and ROM controls I forgot this one LCD density you can change which works flawless I've not discovered any bugs whatsoever uh, but I want to show you a really cool thing. Uh, status bar, battery, status circle. You get the dotted circle. I hope you can see it. The dotted circle is my favorite battery icon and it's in this ROM. I really like it. Of course you can change the clock style. You can also include a greeting. Exodus Android. If you uh, unlock your device, I want to show you that real quick. really nice. So I highly recommend this ROM. Go ahead and install it. You will find all the files in the description and also the XDA thread. I will see you in the next one. Have a great day.